。好一朵美丽的茉莉花，它来自东方，来自中国。它用甜美的歌声赞颂一个伟大民族的光荣，它用美丽的笑容让世界为今天的中国感动。让我们来共同分享这辉煌的一刻。宋祖英，美国肯尼迪艺术中心独唱音乐会，《好一朵美丽的茉莉花》。Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the solo concert of Song Zu Ying. 女士们、先生们，晚上好。宋祖英，美国肯尼迪表演艺术中心独唱音乐会《好一朵美丽的茉莉花》，现在开始。My name is Yang Lan, a television host from China. It is my great pleasure to welcome you all to a fascinating musical journey. Tonight, we're not only going to enjoy a great singer presenting a variety of beautiful folk songs from China, but also we'll experience a collaboration between the best musicians of both countries, and above all, we'll share a dialogue between our hearts and minds. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm very proud to present the National Symphony Orchestra. The Master Chorale of Washington. Let's give a round of warm applause to the conductor, Mr. Tang Mu Hai. Since Puccini used this melody in his opera Toronto. What a beautiful jasmine flower has become the best-known Chinese folk song around the world. We cherish the flower for its elegance, fragrance, a symbol of love. And tonight, no flower is a more fitting description of the singer herself. Ladies and gentlemen, from that antique door will come out the jasmine flower from China, Madame Song Zhu Ying. Enjoy the show.
Lovely. Well, the second song you have just heard was a song of gratitude, a thank you to all of those whose effort brought this concert to life. Uh, Sheng Zuying enjoys tremendous popularity in China, and I think after tonight, she will certainly make more friends here in this country. Am I right? <laughs> the following two songs are Mulan and Happy Days. Well, as you may have known, Mulan is probably the best-loved heroine in Chinese history, a girl courageous enough to disguise herself as a man and join the army in her father's place. Her story has inspired generations of young people, as well as a Hollywood animated film a few years ago. Well, I wish they had heard Song Zuyin's Mulan. Please enjoy Mulan from Jun and Good
好一朵美丽的茉莉花，它来自东方，来自中国。它用甜美的歌声赞颂一个伟大民族的光荣，它用美丽的笑容让世界为今天的中国感动。让我们来共同分享这辉煌的一刻。宋祖英，美国肯尼迪艺术中心独唱音乐会，《好一朵美丽的茉莉花》。Well. Song Tzu Ying started her career from a mountain village of Miao minority ethnic group. The Miao people are never short of great singers. They sing while dating, at wedding, in the rain, under the moonlight, in the mountain, and by the river. Song will return to the stage in her traditional Miao costume, and the handmade silver in the headdress alone weighs as much as six pounds. If you're curious to find out. How it feels to sing with such weight? Probably you can try it home by putting, say, a cast iron frying pan on the head. That's about the weight. She will come out performing two songs. The first one, a song flying out of Miao Mountain, and the second one, Spicy Girl. 请欣赏宋祖英带来的苗岭飞歌和辣妹子。
many of you have gotten it. La la means spicy girls love spicy food. <laughs> so you, you got to be able to eat hot food to be a hot girl in China. <laughs> well, when the Miao girl is getting married, her close friends will come together for a wedding shower. Like everywhere else in the world, such a party is filled with mixed feelings, happiness, sadness, expectations, and also anxieties. The girls will express their feelings through songs. Now, Chen Li Li, Yao Bei Na, and Leia Youduo will join Sun Zhu Ying for this lovely presentation of On the Wedding Day.
Wasn't that lovely? Now let's have some fun. In the next song, Dragon Boat Tune, Sun Zhu Ying may need some help from the audience. She will take the role as a girl crossing the river to greet her relatives for the Chinese New Year. She will ask first in Chinese, I'm crossing the river, would somebody help me? And then she will ask in English, would somebody help me? At that moment, we need a gentleman from our audience to stand up <laughs> and answer bike by saying, I will help you. It's as simple as that, mission accomplished. Who would volunteer to give it a try? <laughs> the gentleman over there, sir, thank you very much. Let me make it very clear, you only need to answer for once. <laughs> because the second time Song asks the same question, the choir will take it over. <laughs> I would say, she's in your hand. Bai tuo, bai tuo, I'm counting on you, okay? <laughs> Let's see how it goes. Please welcome Hubei Minge, Long Chuan Diao. Hao 
And recently, the Library of the Congress of the United States has announced its collection of Song's Vienna concert, as well as her album, which she interpreted uh, the classical songs from a hundred years of Chinese movies. This is the first for a Chinese singer. She has also taken leading roles in Chinese folk operas and musicals, which further enhanced her performing experiences. Now she will come back with a very different song from the ones we have heard, a song that mourns the passing of the beloved. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please join me to give the floor back to the conductor and Song Zhu Ying.
the Great Wall is a landmark on our planet, one of the wonders of the world. There are many stories associated with the Great Wall, and here's one of them. 2,000 years ago, the first emperor, Qing Shi Huang, summoned hundreds of thousands of laborers to build the Great Wall. Meng Jiangnu, a woman who lost her husband in the construction, cried for days and nights. Her sorrow touched heaven and earth, and according to the legend, the Great Wall collapsed before her eyes. 女士们、先生们,请欣赏孟姜女。
雪泪声声欢，天也昏来，地也暗，哭到长长八百里，只见白骨满青山。哭到长长八百里，只见。That happened 2,000 years ago. Today, if you visit China, I can guarantee you, you will still see the Great Wall. For many ethnic groups in China, it is the girl who picks up her date through the singing competition with boys, and the boys will try to impress the girl with their quick wit by trying to solve the riddles in the songs. So here comes the humorous guessing tune. 接下来，宋祖英为我们带来风趣幽默的云南民歌。猜调。Magical word called love. It changes everything that it touches. Uh, in the next song, the moon and the river, Sung Zhu Ying will take the role as a girl missing her boyfriend who travels far away. To her eyes, the moon is reflected in the river, just as love is embraced in her heart, and she wants to follow his steps, just as the river chases the wind. But this time, she will be joined by three mysterious American guests. Guess who? 接下来，请欣赏根据云南民歌改编的《小荷塘水》。
好一朵美丽的茉莉花，它来自东方，来自中国。它用甜美的歌声赞颂一个伟大民族的光荣，它用美丽的笑容让世界为今天的中国感动。让我们来共同分享这辉煌的一刻。宋祖英，美国肯尼迪艺术中心独唱音乐会，《好一朵美丽的茉莉花》。
of now, there are 56 ethnic groups in China. In this concert alone, Sun Tzu Ying has presented more than a dozen different ethnic music styles. Isn't that impressive? <laughs> now she will come onto the stage again with two other songs. The first one, Velvet Flower, is from the score of a wartime romance movie, which was very popular. And the second one, Maila, is about a beautiful, happy, and proud girl in the Western China. 接下来，请欣赏电影《小花》的主题曲《绒花》，以及哈萨克民歌《马伊拉》。Now, ladies and gentlemen, Song Tzu Ying.
the legend of Sung Zhu Ying is a girl who follows her heart and touches the world with her voice. There is a song from West Side Story tonight. It is a perfect description of how she feels for these days. I know a miracle would happen for what you are, what you do, and what you say. We may not call this concert a miracle, but it's definitely a dream come true. And she wants to dedicate this song to all of you because without you, it wouldn't have happened. She will try to sing this song in English. Language may be a barrier, but certainly tonight we have found a common language. Great music connects us, a great singer connects us. On behalf of Sun Tzu Ying, we want to thank you all for the friendship and hospitality we have received in this country, and we welcome you all to China, especially around 2008, to the Beijing Olympic Games. <laughs> Now here's the song, Love My China. Thank you. 